Uh, a little bit, uh, I could say excited, but a lot more still calm and relaxed and trying to avoid being stressed. Well, fortunately for me, I, I don't think I've left uh, or I've had to, I'm coming back to the Lion King. I've been working a Broadway show from day one around the world. So for me, it is an exciting next level adventure. But I have to confess, uh, my expectations were, oh, okay, another one, but the, the exciting uh, challenge became even bigger. The work was amazing. It, it still feels new because the approach was different. Fortunately, like I said earlier, the approach, we're going from the first movie, 20-something years on a Broadway show, to a live action movie, which means it's a continuation for me. We approach the live soundtrack from a live approach, which is really exciting and different, even the way I recorded the choirs in South Africa and America. So it's just an adventure that never ends. And excitement, is still, it feels like a new project. Doesn't feel like I've been doing the same show, same story for 25 years now. Huh? Yes. It is not set up like this. It's the one playing right now. <laughs> he lives in you, which is a song that I originally wrote with Mark for the movie. It didn't make, up, it didn't make it in the movie. Found his home and the Broadway show is performed by Simba, uh, by Mufasa and Rafiq in Broadway. And now we redid the same song in Khosa, which is quite amazing for me. It's still a big, big surprise for me. I'm still kind of still surreal. I started feeling the impact of it globally when I started going on tour with Hans. 